Now, your eyewitness weather forecast. Well, good morning. It is another cool and another gloomy October day with just a passing shower. We'll need to watch for as we go through this afternoon. As we get to the end of this week, a good soaking rain and maybe even a little snow to talk about before we end the month. We'll talk about that over the next couple of minutes, but a step outside right now here in Muncie showing that cloud cover hanging tough once again today, much like it's done over the last couple of days. Satellite and radar showing those clouds really winning out. Now, that being said, there will be a few peaks of sunshine here and there as we go through our afternoon, but the clouds are just going to continue to win out for the rest of our day and that isolated shower later on. We've been talking temperatures in the 40s and 50s. Wilkesbury and Scranton 51. Hazleton were at 45. Mount Pocono 45 and Williamsport coming in right around 51. Not going to get all that much better the rest of our day today. Mostly in the mid 50s this afternoon, which is overall pretty seasonal. Just slightly below the average this year, which comes in right around 57, but a typical October day with a lot of cloud cover. Let's talk about what is now Tropical Storm Zeta. This was a hurricane overnight. Once it hit the Yucatan Peninsula, lost a little steam right now with winds of 65 miles per hour, gusting up to 75, moving to the northwest at 14 miles per hour. It is expected to strengthen back into a Category 1 hurricane before making landfall somewhere along the Gulf Coast. And then those remnants will head our way for the end of this week. But you can see the passing shower that will try to sneak in late today and overnight tonight. Tomorrow we'll try to get a little sunshine back in the afternoon, but looks like the cloud cover will still end up winning out for the most part. A little sunshine to be expected. Here come the remnants of Zeta starting on Thursday morning. It'll start off with some showers coming in, then steadier and even some heavier pockets of rain continue to work their way in right through Thursday afternoon going into Thursday evening. Then things get very interesting as this low starts to move off the coast. Look what's happening behind this colder air is coming in from the north. So if that moisture can hang around Thursday night into early on Friday, take a look at what happens. There's a little snow that we'll have to look forward to, a little changeover action as we get to Friday morning. So here it is. This is just the early details. We'll iron these out a little more as we get closer to the end of the week. Rain develops Thursday morning. Steady rain continues through the day on Thursday. Then it's overnight Thursday. That colder air starts to work its way in. If the moisture can hang around long enough, we will see a change over to snow for Friday morning in some spots. Mostly that would be elevation dependent. So remember, more details to come. Still have a few days to go on this one. 54 for the high today in your eyewitness weather forecast. Mostly cloudy along with a passing shower. Tonight, it's chilly down near 40. Clouds linger again tomorrow at 58. Rain on Thursday into early Thursday night. We'll look for that potential change over to snow Friday morning. But the good news is by the time we get to Saturday, high pressure builds in. Plenty of sun for Halloween. Sure, the kids will love that one near 50. But the overnights near, if not in the 20s, then another shot of cold air Sunday night into Monday. That's actually going to bring us another rain or a snow shower. And we can always download the eyewitness.